Hey everybody, I'm Axel Grave, back with more reactions with the next. As always, remember to support the original content created by using the links on screen and in the description below. If you'd like to support our channel, use the info at the end of this video to like, comment, subscribe, follow, join our Discord, or become a patron at patreon.com slash 3D. Thanks for listening to my boring spiel and I hope you enjoy the video. Going, it is Axel Grave back with more reactions with an X, and I am super happy to get back onto One Piece. Uh, it is a Sunday morning, uh, so we're a little late, but not too late. We, we usually get to them on Sundays and on Saturdays, just busy all the time, and I don't usually get to it that night. Uh, but this is episode 960, and we have finally made it to Act 3, and really uh, more th so than Act 3, it seems like we're starting the flashbacks. Uh, just based on the title card, the chapter title, stuff, etc. Excuse my lips. Like I said, it's early Sunday morning. You tell my hair's still wet from the shower, so we're literally just getting up and at them, trying to rock our day, take care of life stuff as well as reaction stuff. So, hope you guys are watching this for the patrons. Super special shout out as always. And of course, if you're not, you can check the links on both ends for info on how to support us. Remember, always support Ichira Oda, the go to the god. I know I have been forgetting to say it a little lately because we've been super hyped and fucking all over the place trying to take care of like life stuff rent you know moving shit like that so uh yeah i'm super excited to get into the kazuki odin stuff as people don't know if people don't know i have read the manga and i continue to read and keep up with the manga i mean maybe i'll stop one day so i can watch with you guys here on the episodes but man it's just so hard when the series is so good and i've been watching it for 20 years so it's like roughly 20 years maybe a little more or less probably since about 2000 maybe 2001 or two but i'm pretty sure about 2000 sorry about that let's get started super excited everyone has to hydrate do you know do you know And his teeth are cracking. No. I can't remember how they explain this in the manga. What actually happens. To be fair, Sunny's supposed to be from tough. I honestly don't think explosions like that should take it out. Because it's supposed to be made of Adam. Like, there have been times when Sunny's been seriously damaged. And I usually attribute it to who's hitting it. It's usually someone like Big Mom fucking taking a chunk out of it. Usually. And that's not to say it's invincible. Or that it has to be. Yeah, he blew up all the bridges. I remember how he solves this problem, right, with the meeting, but I couldn't remember how he was like, oh yeah, that was a trick with the Sunny. Because you know that they can't destroy the Sunny. Come on, man. Not like that, at least. That's the thing. Oda likes to do things up. Like, if something big happens, he makes it a spectacle. That is fine. We'll rebuild. Damn, he did destroy like fucking a whole bunch of goddamn bridges, didn't he? <laughs> yes, all the numbers, all that shit. It's so annoying, but it's and it's so well written. Bro, oh, is a huge troll. I love it though. It doesn't matter, they still gotta do it, man. You gotta understand. You're asking for something that can't be done, young. These motherfuckers. I'll be pissed. I have to get up under my shit and look at my fucking. 
Come on, man. You gotta understand. Hey, I know he's a kid and he doesn't want him to be hurt, but... Sorry, I was like doing some little bit of stuff on the side, just but they did a really good visionary stuff for that. I might go back for it just a bit because it's still like a password. Listen, mm -hmm. yep, time will eventually come before the world starts to change. Open up the land of Wano. They were trying, man. They were really trying. I do a lot of leaning. Sorry, guys. I know I lean back. This is Kim is like a young one. Hide your wives and daughters. Look at him. Hide the livestock. <laughs> he failed to set sail again. He wants to get out so bad. I think that sound he makes when he walks. I still just remember the one from the where he's like on someone's ashes making the hot pot. That's the one I'm waiting for. That one's so, that shit's so wild. His hair's supposed to be like an Odin bowl, right? Or some shit? I don't know what is up with his hair. He's a big man. How did show us fucking so restrictive I'll be squeezed to death? I'm Odin! And I was meant to boil! Yo! <laughs> I wanna eat Odin! Oh, look, it's a new cross screen! Oh, that's dope! I don't know why I went back to the saw boat though. Oh, whoa, look at those. That's cool though. That makes sense because that was showing off their interactions. Got away from a moving mountain. It was groaning. Ooh. I do remember this story. This is how he meets Kinemon. One platinum coin. Look at him. There's Found thug. I'm taking it. <laughs> I'll sell your organs. Isn't this his wife now? Leave all your clothes. Oh, so he's gonna go steal the boar. Is that a person? Oh yes, this is the scene I was talking about. I was just talking about it. 
Yo, I talked about this just earlier. He's cooking over. He knew homie though. He's, this is his way of paying respect. Even if it is wild as fuck. Thirty-eighth attempt to leave the country illegally. Ah, he's a criminal. How could he return alive? I suspect you probably know, but let me tell you briefly. Odin's father. Yeah. He sent his nanny flying at a year. He caught two rabbits at once. His four, he threw a boulder and knocked out a bear. When he was six, he spent all his time at the pleasure hall wasting the castle's money. When he was eight, he went to a gambling parlor by himself and started a brawl with some hot-blooded gamblers. Uh, when he was nine, he was blacklisted by Yakuza. They repaid them by setting their gambling parlor on fire, instigating a gang war. Then he got arrested for assault. Let's just be real, he the, owns the hood-ass motherfucker. When he served, while serving his time at the quarries, he showed ability and became a master stonemason. This is important for later. 14. Oh yeah, he reroutes a river. With the rock, apparently, that's right. Jesus. But it caused a massive flood. An arrest warrant was issued again. He tried to flee from the country through the channel. But he failed quite miserably. Yeah, he can't sail. He sucks at sailing. He strong all armed a temple master and stayed hidden there. He brought back women from the capital every night and formed a harem. No, they were always free to leave. They just chose not to. But they became furious to go take back their wives and daughters. Group of strong samurai. God, he's really kind of thicker in this than I felt like he was in the manga, like wider. This is what was known as the harem war. Even the hero Guru Romli, who tried to stop them, got involved and took a great scuffle. The flower. He's only 18 at that point, yeah. Yeah, that means he only makes it to about 40. Notice of disavow. Kind of frees him, though. Damn, bro. I wonder he could stay in... Well, you'll learn later. That shit gets intense, bro. But that does actually give some foreshadowing. Look at big dude. <laughs> so cool. Oh man, look at how big he is back then. But don't engage one-on-one, -on -one. he's stronger than you guys. Amy looks way different. Of course it's gonna be gone. Tricky dude. That guy's a little dumb though. Oh man. It's a weapon. Ah, that's just so funny. Yeah, we'll continue charging. Hello. 
Mountain God. I didn't know it was white. I guess I, maybe I did. That is a good sized mountain. White boar like a mountain. That's why it's called the Mountain God. It destroyed the whole region. Thought it was just a myth, baby! The other guys were doing it too, though. I mean, partially your fault. Hello. One strike. But I don't think he kills it, which is also crazy. Come on. Don't make me wait another episode for this. His teeth are a little... The lines on his teeth were a little fucked up right there for a moment. Their lining just sometimes bothers me in the new arc. But I think it might be on purpose. Yeah, look at him look down on them, literally. But give me the board now. Damn, they are gonna make us wait. What? That could have been finished there. Alright, but that was a fun episode, man. That is not, not oh wait. No, 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 it's gonna be the preview. Uh this but yeah, no, that was a good episode. I really enjoy that episode 960, much like the ones leading up to it have been pretty dope, man. Like, despite some of the slower pacing in Wano, I still think they do a really good job and make it worthwhile to like sit and watch One Piece, right? Like, some shows, it's really tough for me to get through parts, so I'll just skip entire sections. And that's not to say I don't do that in One Piece too at certain points to get to the fun parts sometimes. But the whole point of One Piece is that it is about those middle points, right? About the build-up and about the story as opposed to the action. And this really exemplifies that of like, all right, this is Odin. And like half of this is just them like uh, bragging on Odin. You know, he's like at four, he did this. At six, he did this. And he's such a wild, he's, he's wild. And you know what I mean? I swear he's crazy and I love it. Like if Odin was... In America, he'd be a hood guy, like, 100%. He'd be fucking out there gambling on the corner, playing fucking Bones. Fucking, you know, you feel me, though? Just, like, oh, I love it when they make characters like that who are, like, so good and relatable. It's just, like, yeah, he's just free, and, like, everybody kind of wants to be that way, right? To do what they want to do and, like, not have to really work. Not work, but worry about the consequences and uh, not have to work too hard towards something. Not to say that we're, Odin doesn't work hard, but he's just kind of, like, naturally gifted and big and and skilled and uh, a kazuki and uh odin is odin i love that whole part with him eating odin off the dude's grave it's so wild in the manga in here it's so great like they gotta make a comp of that one i want to see the fucking comp of them eating off the grave someone's gotta do it uh anyway thanks for watching guys as always i appreciate everybody who does comment like you know come chat with me in our discord and talk about one piece and a bunch of other stuff we're trying to get more people added in and talk with more people more often but unfortunately we're just been out of it uh we're hoping to get back into it we got a big plan it's not always goes the, doesn't always go the way we want but we're hoping it does in the future as always uh if you enjoyed watching remember support the original content creator ichiro oda uh read the mango watch it the anime on crunchyroll or wherever you can get it to support them and, uh, you know, if you like supporting us, you can check the bumpers on both ends in the description below to do the same. Thanks, and uh, we'll catch you next time on Reactions with an X. If you enjoyed watching or want to support the channel, remember to attack that like button. Subscribe on YouTube, follow on Twitch, or join our Discord using the link on screen or in the description below so that you can get daily updates on all of our uploads and live streams. We know we're not perfect, and we can always improve. So please visit our Discord or comment below with a critique or a compliment to let us know how we can improve ourselves. Finally, if you're just starting for more content, you can become an honorary member of 3D Productions at patreon.com slash 3D and get exclusive access for as low as a dollar a month.
This will also give you early access to all of our online content, including comics, gaming, music, and of course more of these reactions. Even if you're not able to do any of this, it means the world to me that you'd sit down and watch my video all the way through to the end. So I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart. Thank you. I'm Axel Grave, and I hope to see you next time for more reactions with the next.